7,000 pounds of spreading force. That's what the average set of hydraulic spreaders on the market today offers for vehicle shredding. Ah! Door popping. Ah! Raw metal crushing power. Ah! But how strong is that really? Is it strong enough to do what every single one of us have wanted to do to the crew that keeps stealing all of our condiments? No, 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 no. There it is. The answer is yes, but what if you had a multiple car pile up, your airbags have failed, and the only thing you have is your spreaders to help rescue a helpless squirrel trapped underneath all of the chaos? Let's find out. And to test out this fake squirrel protecting scenario, we gathered ourselves a few crushed cars, a telehandler, and Genesis Rescue Systems' new E-Force S54 spreaders. And to make sure we're lifting these vehicles as safely as possible, we got ourselves the TL9 stabilizer. But you know, safety. Let's get the first one. The average vehicle weighs around 3,000 pounds with the highest spreading force of the Genesis S54 being 15,300 pounds. This is gonna be a cakewalk. Like butter. Let's get the second. All right, let's see if the 32 inch max spreading distance will be good enough to lift the weight of my mom's crushing disappointment in me, which also happens to feel like 6,000 pounds. I can't do something right. Get the third car. All right, let's see if three cars will slow this baby down. I'm thinking not. <laughs> okay. Boom, just as I suspected. Three no problem all day long. You know what? Let's up the ante. Add two more. All right, let's see what five cars does to this baby. <laughs> oh, day! You know what? We only have two cars left. Let's throw them up top. <laughs> All right, let's see if this baby can lift seven whole vehicles. Let's go! Oh, 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 man, man, that's the sheer power that you would want from a tool if you were trapped under a vehicle. Right, Mr. Squirrel? Yeah, that's right. right. Well, I hope you found this video educational, or at least entertaining. Either way, yeah, buddy.